Hello everyone, my name is Duncan, and last month, N9 Games, developers behind popular survival horror game The Forest, released that their upcoming game, Sons of the Forest, will be delayed. Now this was kind of expected, since there was no real news about anything for a little while, and still the Steam page had not come up. So the date was set from late May back to October, and not expecting any new news for at least a couple of months, they out of nowhere surprised us with a tweet saying that they now have a Steam page for Sons of the Forest. No new things were mentioned in this post. However, if we go to the Steam page, we can find a couple of little hints and details about the new game. As well as a new publisher. Now this new publisher is called New Knight, and seeing how close of a name it is to End Knight, we can assume that it's still the same company. Usually when you would make a new publishing name, that would mean that they want to release other games that they don't develop themselves, right? So who knows what we can see from New Knight in the future. But of course that's not why we're here. We're here for Sons of the Forest news. There wasn't a whole lot of new things, however there was a little bit more story information. So apparently the whole reason we're going to this island is to find and save a billionaire. However, nothing else was given besides that. We did already know that some military force was sent to the island, but now we actually know the reason why. If we read a little more down, we can also assume that pretty much all the NPCs that are in the helicopters during the trailer will end up dying. And the way they do co-op will probably be similar to the forest, to where one of the people in the helicopter will survive. The reason we can assume that NPCs won't make it is because they won't be quote-unquote barking orders at you. Which is an interesting take. We all expect it after the forest. The main reason why you would come to this new island is as Timmy trying to figure out what's going on and probably save himself? Find a cure for whatever is going on with his body right now? But it seems like we might just be a different person or Timmy joined this private army? Who knows, there's still lots to be learned about that, hopefully we can see some more in the upcoming months. And the other big review is that Seasons are coming to Sons of the Forest. Now Seasons are generally not in survival games, and the ones that have it are kind of few and far between. We did get glimpses of this beforehand with the little hut that was in the snow. However, at the time we could have kind of expected that to be a similar snow location to what the forest had. But who knows, maybe this is actually a shot of winter. The big change that scenes are going to bring to the game is the way you manage your food. In the forest, you could just hunt whenever you want, whatever you want at all time. However, it seems that specific species of fish and potentially berries and everything else you can grow will be limited to what season you're in. And during the winter months, it'd be really hard to get food. So you need to stock up and preserve that food. However, by the sounds of it, enemies will be more active during this time, because they are scouring for food themselves. That is all the new information we got of Sons of the Forest. Stay tuned, because we will be updating you as soon as there's new information. Bye everyone.